Hey everyone, I'm Simple from Motion Tutorials, and today I am going to show you how to create this. So let's get started with Illustrator, as you can see I already have my illustration ready, you can see this, here I have already separate leg parts on different layers, because then it's easy to rig in after effects. And don't forget to rename the layers. Here I have made a reference layer because I want to know where my joint is. You can see my leg shapes. The shape of the legs, near the joints, should be rounded so that there won't be any pointy edges while animating. And black dot should be in between the joint. So let's import this illustration file into After Effects. First of all, create a new composition. Let's call it Legs Animation. Here I have an HD default setting, which is 1920 by 1080 with a 29.97 frame rate. Duration 1 second is enough. You can change these settings according to your project requirements. With everything set, click OK. Now import your illustration file into After Effects and choose Composition Retain Sizes, and hit Open. Drag Legs Composition into the timeline, and double click the composition layer. First, we need to change this black background, so go to the composition setting and choose whatever color you want. As you can see here all layers are separated, so now it's time to start rigging using Duik plugin. Duik is a very powerful tool to rig your characters and is totally free. Go to the window and select Duik Basel. As you can see this Duik Basel plugin looks like this, select leg options and choose human leg structure then click on create button. As you can see this, leg structure is created, so now we need to align the bones with our legs. Before we need to hide hip layer from time align, then you can easily to align with thigh. First, align it with thigh and then with calf. Here I made a black circle as a reference for the calf bone, so you can easily align it. And the last one is foot, then select all structure layer and drag all layers to the bottom side. Now it's time to parent all leg layers with leg structure so first select thigh layer and use pick whip tool for a parent, go ahead with the same process. Select calf layer and parent with calf structure. Then select foot and parent with foot structure. Select all structure layers and then select the option of Auto Rigger and IK in the Duik plugin. As you can see this foot controller has been created, and this is the effect controls of the foot, let's do some little bit modification in the foot controller. Drag foot controller layer to the bottom side, and then select all left leg layers, and change layer color whatever you want. Select foot control layer, and go to effect controls panel. You can easily change this foot color and size. You can take any color of your choice. And also you can adjust the size of foot. Now let's move this foot controller and here you can see the foot controller is moving in the wrong direction, go to the effect controls and uncheck this reverse option of the foot and also uncheck this stretch option. Select the foot layer and then move this foot controller, it's really awesome that's why I like Duik plugin. Apply the same process on the other foot.
rigging process are done, so let's animate legs, but first, we'll hide all unwanted layers from the timeline. So select unwanted layers, and click on the shy icon button, and don't forget to turn on this shy icon. I just need only foot controller layers and hip layer for the run cycle so you can hide other layers from the timeline. Now we need to connect the thigh bones to the hip. Here I have hidden all the extra layers. Let me click the shy button here to unhide them. This is the bone for left thigh. I will just select this and parent it to the hip layer. Do the same for the right thigh. Select the right thigh structure layer and grab pick whip tool, and parent with the hip. As you can see I have an IK rig for my legs. Now I will hide all the unwanted layers from the timeline by clicking the shy button. Now we will take run cycle reference of Richard Williams. This is a very helpful reference for the run cycle so let's follow this reference. First, select this foot controller layers and press P this is a shortcut key of the position. Then add keyframes. Select foot keyframe and then move foot controller, but before creating animation just take a grid for the reference. As you can see the time I am moving the foot controller, it is not bending properly, but the time I am moving hip on the downward direction then it is bending properly. Now go through the Richard Williams reference but it's not necessary to make all poses. Here I just made a contact and pass pose in the tutorials so you can go ahead with reference. Let's play the animation. Run cycle is good enough but we can make better than this, so let's little bit move hip part, select hip layer and press P then click on the stopwatch icon. 
a little bit move here player according to Rant Cycle. Here we have done, contact and pass pose, regarding the reference. Now let's play this. This already looks good enough, now let's smooth it, by tweaking the animation graph. Select all keyframes and right click on it, then choose keyframes assistant and select easy ease. You can also use keyboard shortcut F9 for easy ease. Go to the graph editor and once again select all keyframes and choose this option. Looks awesome to me. It's playing nice and smooth, hope you like too. If you liked the video, please like, comment and subscribe. Also, share your walk or uncycle video link in the comments section. See you next time.